Yo, why are you eating that so loudly? How's your what? How's your apple? It's my favorite fruit, man. Apples make your junk taste so good. What? Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to 10-Minute Podcast. Hey, welcome to the 10-Minute Podcast. My name is Will Sasso. And I'm Chris D'Elia. The way you're... Sna- it's just so obnoxious. Can we just... Why are you eating it like that? Say your name. I'm Brian Callum. Right. Why would you have to eat that now? Yeah. Apples are so fucking good for you, and they make you junk. Uh, Tastes like bubble gum. No, <laughs> no, what? they don't. Yeah, no. Don't be one of those guys because there's always guys that are like, oh yeah, pineapple. Yeah, it makes your yeah. Uh, pineapple does. But pineapple okay. makes your thing apple? like this. Celery oh. makes you, you you shoot with a apple. more apple makes you shoot further. Oh. Cake apple makes shrinks your cake, prostate. Cake makes you it shrinks your prostate. So cake makes you, you take taste your penis tastes like cake if you rub it all over your penis. Dude, have you heard that one? That if you have to, if you if you well, actually take cake and yeah, rub it, it all over your sense. penis, it makes your penis taste yeah, like cake. Sense, so, but, Brian, just eat your fucking apple. Don't. But hurry up and eat to, it. Stop eating it into the fucking microphone. No, I want to share this with people because women love they fucking love when your junk tastes like bubble gum. Why but wouldn't they? Bubble gum is great. That's true, but why does it, how does apple make you taste like bubble gum? It does something chemically to your, to your downstairs area. So it's like a gift. We were we were thinking that <laughs> here's what we were thinking. We we're thinking that today we would uh, dedicate the show to the ladies and do a show just for the ladies. Well, since we started out, yeah. So. Well, things have started off a little weird, truly. But um, you know, on on the ten minute podcast, things tend to skew a little male because we're so manly. We're such manly guys. Uh, that it just can't help but be a boys club. Um, but today we we want our female listeners out there to know that we are thinking about you. We want the show to be for you too. And Brian wants you to um, put your mouth on his bubble gum. Uh, there's nothing like that. What? And there's nothing like what? You've you've tasted a guy no, bubble gum? Gross. But All right, well, there's nothing like what then? Just to just just to give a woman your essence like that. Just like just be like, here you go. This is for you. What do you mean? Actually say that? Yeah, yeah that's what, you, you actually say that during when sex. You climax like that, you're just what like, you say? yeah, here you go. Merry Christmas in July or whatever. Wait, you say it in uh, July? Yeah, or sometimes you're just like, here, taste this filthy sweet. <laughs> Why are you? Don't do that with your hands. Why? Because I thumb off? Yeah, yeah you're thumbing yeah, off. Yeah, use my thumb. thumb. Sometimes you can be like this too. You can be like, oh, here come the white sweet worms. White sweet worms, bubblegum worms. <laughs> if a girl, if you had sex with a girl for the first time and you said that, she that. would think you were fucking clinically insane. Well, Here come my sweet white worms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, I, I always say this. Too. I always say, oh, I'm going to fall. Why? Why? <laughs> And then Why? I fall on them. Oh, you're you know a big guy, say? dude. Yeah. How? I say, mayonnaise sandwich. Oh, gross. And I that's fall not, on them. That's not you know safe. I... So wait, so then you, you shoot, you, you get, it's on them, and then you go mayonnaise sandwich, and it just like yeah, that? Yeah, and I go, you're a hot dog bun. I'm a, I'm a French loaf. And that's, I fall. Ew. That's not a trick. That makes fall. me want to You know what I do? You know what I do? want to throw up. You, you know what I do? I go, this is exactly what I do every single time whenever I have a climax. I always go like this and I say it like this. I'm from Connecticut. <laughs> Why? Is that, I don't know. Does the girls like that? Why I don't you, know. But you're not com- from Connecticut. I know I'm not, but I just look so at them. And, I, and the face, you guys can't see the face I do, but I kind of do like the face that all sitcom stars do yeah. on a, a poster. You look like, like somebody, what the heck? Yeah. And I you go, look like that, but I say. You look like the long-haired guy in the Whitney billboard. Well, no, that is me. But, oh, that is But you, what I do sorry. is, and then when I climax, I, I go like that. I do that face and I say, I'm from Connecticut. <laughs> What do they say? That's they so, you never do, really say anything. You but do they, look a little. It, it, for our listeners, he looks a little like Johnny Galecki in Big Bang Theory without the glasses when he does that face. Right, right. He's kind of. I'm from Connecticut. Yeah, it's pretty. God cool. God bless you. That's how I say that. Sometimes. My knees. Why do you say <laughs> my that? knees? Yeah, my knees. All right. Oh yeah. So how is this for the? I don't, I don't understand. How I don't this know is for the how this is for okay. the ladies. So hey, let's get back ladies, on track here. Ladies, here. This is what I want to say. Ladies, help us out. <laughs> what do you want the show to be about? Oh, there's no one here but us. Yeah, no, it's just so us. we have to deliver a show for the ladies. I think that women want to connect emotionally, and I think that they want to—they um, want the real you. You know, a lot of times we tend to it 
attach sort of a construct on on you know where we play a masculine guy and they play a feminine guy. Right. But I think what women feminine want feminine girl. You said feminine connect. guy. You I said mean, feminine, feminine guy. girl. Right. But I think they just want to connect on a human level. Women always want kind of a connection. And yeah, but men, it's hard nowadays. Women can't really do that because the world's full of douchebags and bitches. So you don't know if you're like a good person and not a douchebag, and you're out there with a chick who's a good girl and not a bitch. Then maybe okay. you have well, a shot. Yeah, but, 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 but usually what happens is is I'm a good guy and I'm hanging with a bitch. Okay, well. Or sometimes I think a chick is a bitch, but she's not. She's a good girl. Right. And then I'm being a fucking douchebag because okay. I think she's a fucking bitch. It's like who and no can... one gets no one gets anywhere when right. that happens. You're coming off a little bit harsh, but yeah, it's like it's, it's like you impressive. trying to you're trying to beat the bitch by being a douchebag before her bitch. No, 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 no. That's the fucking problem with uh, these douchebags. That's, douche the, problem. Bags. that's okay. the problem with these douchebags is because they go, well, I'm going to be a bigger fucking douchebag. And Brian's right. You just got to be yourself. And the the thing what what it is is uh, it come, it's it's all about being yourself no matter what. But in, in the face of bitchness All right. and just making sure that you're giving to the world, giving your gift. But you, you keep pushing, you keep like punching bitch. Yeah, the way you're saying bitch, you're it's saying so aggressive. bitch. Like, yeah. just no, say, because I say it like NWA. I say it like Ice Cube and Drain. Well, you don't really say it like that, though. It sounds because, like you don't like women. Yeah. I love that. women. I love women. And I think uh, that we are, as a species, uh, about to return to harmony with between men and women. Well, now and you I know that, like I know that I've, gone, I've gone through my own uh, little bit of a metamorphosis. Sure, I grew up with what I like to call now FTS, which is fat teenager syndrome. Sure, maybe the girl in high school didn't like me, even though I was on television while I was in high school. Mm. And hey, I was captain of the football team. Okay. But she never, right. I didn't well, get laid okay. until I was about 20 or 21. Right. Well, well, listen, Will, you yeah. sound dangerously close to blowing up a building. No. Yeah, no, <laughs> you really do. And no. I, but now, but now. Uh, I'm, You're I'm, holding on to the ch both chairs with both hands. It's no, like, I'm what not. are you doing? I'm not. Your okay, knuckles but are, you are but No, I'm not. You are. I'm just, Your face is so red. <laughs> um, it's because it's hot in here right well, now. Well, you seem mad here, or something. And you, okay, I'm not look, mad. So anyway, ha, the fact, this is for the ladies. This podcast is yeah. 10 minutes. So far, it's been seven minutes. Nothing has been about the ladies. <laughs> so why don't you guys just... What do you do to... Uh, I connect with them. I talk right. right so you, you're saying is you connect with them I connect with emotionally. Them. Yeah. You show them you. I don't push anything. You don't... I, okay. I, I, I get into their space. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm doing right now? This is a seductive voice. Well... And I listen and, um, and I thank them. Okay. And then I, and then, then, then I, p I peel, I just peel my piece out. No, don't. See, do that. that the whole thing is like the. No, I'm saying that's what you're saying. I'm saying that when you, you say, don't, God don't bless go, you, no, that's no, not going to work. Don't go into the sex right away. Right. Connect with them. First. Laugh with them. For how many dates? Treat them like a queen. For how many dates? For at least half the date. Okay. And then what? And then you know, peel out your junk you know, and say, this is for you. Well, what you're like saying. That, you're that is exactly how you did it. You know, all know, this is for you. That's, that's exactly what I thing. said. That's exactly, exactly what you I know, said. You know, all joking aside, what I really enjoy doing around ladies is not saying anything. Because mm, I'm a verbose person, and uh, you know I make my living uh, talking as an actor. You're also a spaz and completely ridiculous when it comes to women because you don't know how to behave around them. Now I, I no don't want to be rude. That's not true at but all. But that is very true. No, you that's are a not fucking true. Fucking spaz. I'm not, I'm not a fucking spaz. I'm not trying to be you're rude. I'm not trying to be rude. But you're spaz. Uh, let me, let me, no. I'm, I'm awesome around women. Women are very very comfortable around me. No. You don't, uh, yeah, yeah, you don't know are. how to speak. You, the, the, the minute you get around women, you're like, this is Will. This is Will on a date. This is Will yeah. on a date. Um, you know, like fucking. <laughs> I got my, can I have a pickle? <laughs> That's Will when on a dinner date. When the fuck I ever said that? <laughs> That's Will on a dinner date. I would never say Do that. Do you have cheese? <laughs> You're making that, you're making that, that Connecticut face that is, again. It, that's such a good impression of Will. It's no, it's not. No, it's not. But that's I'm why a, you got to take a girl back to her house or your house. You treat her like a lady. You do some soft poetry in her ear. You say, I'm a wonderful jaguar. What? I'm whispering in your ear. I love you. We're both beautiful people. And then right when you climax, you say, I'm from Connecticut. Uh, don't, no, why the Connecticut thing again? So why not? Gross. I'm, a, so I'm like a philosopher. Why not? Hey, uh, hey gals. We hope you enjoyed this. <laughs> the show for you oh man i'm actually i'm actually really good on a date you know what i always say on dates don't ever say anything don't share anything on a date that they can't just google on their own or in my case imdb because i'm a very very successful actor all right so uh, hey, by the I way say, if you do the i'm from connecticut thing tweet us because i want to hear about it i say to women i usually say as long as you do everything i fucking say and and, and you understand that i am your king we're gonna get along incredibly well 
And no woman. In, it, and I like my sandwiches toasted. <laughs> thanks and for listening like to the 10 minute on the podcast. Fucking floor, and uh, thanks and you for. You have to groom my dog. Thanks for subscribing <laughs> and listening on iTunes. We're on Stitcher Smart Radio. And check us out on uh, Twitter at, at 10 Min Pod. I'm from fucking Connecticut. Spaz. You're a spaz. I'm not a fucking spaz. You're a spaz How about dude. I fucking separate every bone in your fucking body? Don't get aggressive. <laughs> I got caught by the paparazzi today. All right, dude. I know. I got caught by the paparazzi okay. today. That's I was leaving a, a deli in You're Beverly not that Hills. Famous, though. I was having an yeah. Israeli right. salad and uh, right, tuna more salad. Why are you just be- chopped vegetables? You're obviously lying I'm low, because I'm you're low, being low, low specific about what you're, you're eating. Right? It was about the paparazzi. Low carb. Low carb. Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. That's why you listen to Ten Minute Podcast. I was, I was hey, low. listen. Why did you? Who gives a fuck your low carbon? I'm low, low carbon, man. Don't say it like that. Like it's I'm a fucking, your, it. like it's an event. Yeah, your current event in it. I'm low carbon. It. Nah, it makes me mad. Well, whatever. Sometimes people get mad. I went to the dentist, then I went to the deli to Who just get some. Great work. story so far. And then oh, I went man. and I got this paparazzi guy. Great. Story. Oh, really? Yeah. My reach is really far. My reach, my, what I do with my comedy, what I do with All my right. gift, oh, God. what I do with my acting, oh, uh, God. dramatic acting and you comedic don't, acting. You're only in comedies and it's always... You play to stooge. No, yeah. I do. I you do. play to stooge. You never did stooge. a dramatic no, thing in your I've done, life. Oh, 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 really? You played oh, a stooge ever. where you had oh, no lines. Oh, for you just fu- made noise. You for five idiot. years before I fucking even moved to LA when nah, I was a teenager, nah, I wasn't on an award-winning yeah, dramatic nah, series. Not a no? teenager anymore. No. I just fucking I just did two dramatic stooge. movies back to back. You wow, played a really? stooge. Oh, okay, was fucking was Liam Neeson in them? Yeah, they're hoping for Was he for, in no, either of them? No, they're no. hoping for a DVD oh, okay, deal. Then, How's that? Then hey, explain you guys, yourself. But you guys, Will Liam Sasso is in it. Uh, bam. <laughs> fucking bam. You guys Check this you? out. Mm. Give me my daughter back. Pretty right, well, pretty good. I want whatever you took from me. That's actually not a good Liam. Well, you it's a little what, Irish. Uh, what is he, Scottish? No, no he's just... He's uh, Irish. He's Irish. He's Irish. He's Irish. Yeah, but he's... So he's that's not... He's, he's, he's sounding like a leprechaun. That's want, if he no, was a leprechaun. You took something from me and I want it back now. No, that's like Braveheart. No, that's, yeah, yeah. You sound... You actually sound like you're not even from... So I want, oh, fuck he, He'd be like, here, here we go, go Brian. Uh, here we go, Brian. You're going to fuck it all up. They will take you. Listen to me now. They're going to take you. Listen no, that's, to me now. No, he's right. That's the way it sounds. They will take you. They will take you. No, listen, kind of like you, this. You will be taken. Oh, you will be taken. I have a very Here's what's specific... going to happen. No. You put down a phone, <laughs> no, leave it. it on. That's not it. Here's what's going to happen. I have a very specific set of skills. Of course. I promise oh, I will find you and I will kill you. No, no, no. It's more like this. Listen to me. I've no. got a real specific set of skills. That's not it. Dude. Here's what we'll do. I can do karate. I can do judo. <laughs> and I'm real good at poison. That's yeah. that's not even. That's what that was, That's who is that? Liam Neeson. It's not Liam Neeson. That was man. in Taken. Look, I no, no, I no. I know a thing or two about voices and impersonations and stuff. And here's my best Liam Neeson. Okay. I'm Liam Neeson, man. <laughs> That's nah, I'm Liam Neeson. No, that's no. always the eighth character in a Guy Ritchie movie. That's yeah, what you're doing. Yeah, I am the eighth ri- character in a Guy Ritchie movie. Who's the guy with the fucking bald head? Yeah, that dude. Lock, stock, and two yeah. smoking barrels. That guy's Roar, a real fun. The boy Sam's lawyers. Yeah. You boys gonna get off, and you know what you're gonna do. Yeah, that's But here's what you're gonna do for me. After you get a game, Raw, put it together. Then you come back, and if you don't come back, then I'll find you. And if I found you, why don't you <laughs> bound you? I don't know. I'll how is it. that? That's not bad. How is that? How did, did they find that guy? Is that, he, was a, he was a real fighter. That guy's killed He was a, he was a bare knuckle you fighter. You know him? Yep. I'd read, there's a book he wrote. Oh. He was a bare knuckle fighter wow. in England and took on all comers back in the day. And he was just a legendary tough guy. Wow. Really? Oh, yep. Fuck, uh, and, that's so and, weird. And he was just a legendary badass, a real tough you, guy. You know how like, so he was, he's old now. So do you think like back then with, when he used to knock people out, you know how everyone advances, advances like baseball players now are way better yes. than Babe Ruth. Yes. Do you think that he could beat me up? Yeah. I, uh, he would, he, would, bare he, knuck, could, he bare could not, not only beat you up, he could fuck you. Uh, this is a true story. Shane Carwin, who you guys know as the um, heavyweight uh, who beat the crap out of Brock Lesnar until uh-huh, he, but he, lost. he gassed. Well, he gassed in the second round, but he's too. He after a workout, he's a trim two eighty five at six one. And I looked at him, and he was so big, and he squats like seven hundred pounds, and he benches five fifty. I squat. I squat eight hundred. He, he's the biggest. 620. Well, okay, but he's the biggest. He's the biggest man in the world. 
and 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 the biggest and the toughest guy in the world. A six I, six foot one, two hundred eighty five pound man is the biggest man in well, the world. Well, in that no, he's, no. he's the biggest. He's, he's the, the biggest man in the world if you're the dumbest man in the world. No, 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 no. What I mean by that is that he's the he's, he's the biggest the, man. He's, in pro, the world. he's arguably the toughest guy in the world, the best fighter. Like he can beat the shit out of pretty much everybody. Maybe two people on the planet can't beat him up, right? And I and, thank you. And I said to him, I go, I go. Um, what? Why do you mean thank you? He said, "What did you say?" No, I didn't compliment you. You Chris. said two people in the world. No, I didn't compliment you. You're being ridiculous. You now. thought he was talking about you? Oh yeah. No wait. Well, I'm sorry. What were you not? Spe- you weren't specific. No, I was talking about Shane Carwin. And who, how many people can beat him up? Maybe. Like two people. Thank you very much. No, you can't. Well, what beat are you him saying? Who? He's talking about. You. Uh, they're like they might be Junior Dos Santos, maybe. Am I the and other? And maybe person? one other guy out there. I don't know. Thank you very much. But it'd be oh, a Chris, close fight. You think so it's you're you. saying so? You're saying Junior Dos Santos and me? No. Could maybe best. You would suck his cock. No. You would suck his cock. No, 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 no. No, no. You would be his his cock sucker. No. He'd grab you by with one of those meaty hands, grab no, the no, back no. of that beautiful mane of hair. No, thank you, but no. And, and your mouth would be used as not only his 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 dick his dick uh, vacuum. No. But also, <laughs> if he ran out of toilet paper, you would clean his rump no. if he so chose. No, no, no. Hey, I bought He's it. A very I nice actually man. was on. I was on late uh, late night last night. I was watching infomercials. I bought a dick vacuum. Okay, well, <laughs> easy vacuum. payments because you're dealing with a nub. <laughs> Tired of picking up your own dick? Yeah. There's got to be a better way. There is now with the dick vacuum. <laughs> didn't didn't we have a? Uh... It's just guys picking up dicks and then a red X over it in black and white. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let me ask you this. Here, here's the thing. When I look at the three of us as three guys that do a podcast, yeah. Um, Brian, you've hopped around a fucking mat here and there. You've you've done some wrestling. Oh right? yeah. Oh yeah. You've done you've done some boxing. You know your way around the gym. Yeah. Chris, you've done some what some jujitsu. Yeah. Dance. That sort of thing. You're some also dance. you're a big guy. What are you, six three? Um yeah, about six three. About six three. Yeah. You're six one and a half. I no, am not you. No, Chris fucking is a tall asshole. guy. He's, he's almost six three. He's I'm about six, six three. three. I, I, I he's got he's got nah. broad shoulders. I'm nah. I'm I'm a natural six three and I'm I'm built like if a Kodiak bear oh. and a silver back gorilla fucked. Uh, yeah, we know. That's Oh, what would then you shaved yeah. it and put fucking Bruce Willis's face on it. Okay, like yeah, a young I mean, Bruce Willis. You know, like, no, don't man. push it. Yeah, you know, man. yeah. 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 I'm, I have. You know when like Tom Selleck shaves his fucking mustache for a for a western, and you're like, sure, yeah. Whoa, he's beautiful. That's right. my face. No, no man. So I've got no. I've got a gladiator no, gladiator helmet for a face and a no, Kodiak man. bear That's gorilla not even body. Necessarily no, if good. Tom Selleck I, ate a shitload of sodium. My, if he guzzled sodium, went to sleep. For five, hey, 15 hours off. and fuck woke you. up and then held his breath for a minute. But wait, that's what your face would look like. <laughs> that's very mean. But, but here's no, my point. You, here's I'm my point. Saying. I don't think, and I'd like, I'd like actually, I'd like people to weigh in on this. You can write about this in the in the in our iTunes reviews. You can hit us up on Twitter at, at Ten Min Pod. You can hit us up on Facebook slash Ten Min Pod. Is there a I, podcast out there that can beat up the Ten Minute Podcast? I don't think so. I think we beat the shit out of just about any podcast out there. Well, yeah, that's Rogan, pretty Rogan, abstract. That's yeah, pretty abstract three of us, because the three of us would converge don't on Rogan. fight. You know, Rogan is the only guy who would. Yeah, but fucking, the three of us. Would, oh, you're would, saying would the three? Oh, you're saying yeah, no, us three versus any other podcast. We'll oh, beat the man. shit out of any yeah, podcast. Maybe. Yeah, but there's who some... the fuck? Who do we get? It's a bunch of hipster fucking yeah, that's comedians. True. That's pretty true. A bunch of weird fucking you know guys yeah. like you know connect doing. Well, Rogan maybe could beat the shit out of the three of us. Together. No, 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 no. no. I'll, I'll, no. I'll, I'll, not, I'll, not a shot. Not a shot. Okay. Not the three of us. Because you're saying because of my background. You're saying you're saying now because of my background. No, you we don't need. Here's you, what you he'd would do. If, if, no, if we fought Joe Rogan, Will and I would have to take him out, and we'd, no. we'd come in on him, converge on him. You would hop around, no. producing estrogen, no. and going like this, because no. you wouldn't know what to do, because you you faint, and then you would faint, because you faint at even a little bit of violence. You know, you no, I think you know what they call me you're a when I took jujitsu. I took jujitsu for six years. You know what they called me? What's what? that? Legs McGee. That's a, sh- that's a they that's did because they couldn't get around him. They couldn't get around him. No matter what happened, they couldn't get around him. I think I think that there's I don't think there's a podcast out there that we couldn't beat the living snot out of. Adam Carolla has a history in boxing, but there's three of us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we so are. Uh, we we, we be- should actually take over and bully the other podcast. Let's do that. I really want to do that. I really want to beat the shit out of some other uh, some some of our great okay, podcast so competition. What do you want to call our gang? Ten minute podcast. Nah, we need a better gang name. Um, um the Razors. No. The scorpions, the, how black, about, the black scorpions. Uh, how, about, how, about the, how about the poisonous snakes? No, that's just kind of like something the, already. The, the you know? vipers. Um, no, that's already. How about something. the baseball furies? They were the toughest gang in the Warriors. That movie, the I know, Warriors. Dude, but they no, already, but let's make up our own thing. Yeah, let's make like, up our own. How about uh, this? 
fucking doozlemites. Doozlemites. We're the doozlemites. Doozlemites. Yeah, that's what we are. Made up a word, dude. That's the best thing. You don't know how bad it doozle might hey, can fuck you up. Hey, thanks for listening to the Ten Minute Podcast. We're the doozle mites. And uh, thanks for subscribing and downloading. Doozle mites. That's our that's our gang song. Please subscribe if you haven't already on iTunes. We're on Twitter. Doos. Shut the fuck up. The doozies. Shut the fuck up. We're on Twitter at Ten Minute Pod. Oh God. Facebook slash Ten Minute Pod. We're also oh, on Stitcher. At Stitcher, Stitcher Smart at Radio. At Brian Campbell. Never at go Will to Sasso. his. At Will Sasso. Hamfatter.com. Hey, here come the. No, don't do that. Chris man. is making a mouth noise and I'm breathing. Yeah, man, don't do that. It's so creepy. Honestly, it makes me see it balls my fist up. No, Chris, I want to punch somebody in the face, man. Don't do that, dude. Some podcasts are slow and you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to 10 Minute Podcast. Uh, welcome to the 10 Minute Podcast brought to you by Amazon.com. Go to our fucking website and no, hit the banner. No. <laughs> Chris no. says don't, nah, nah. but we'll get... Don't all do right. that. Don't support the show. Go to... And Gamefly. Don't matter. Don't go to Gamefly. No. That's no. also on our site. It's all on the site, 10minutepodcast.com. No. Tell, tell us who you are, Will. My name is Will Sasso. I'm Brian the Kid Callum. And I'm Chris D'Elia, and I'm lounging. I'm lounging Dude, like... Chris. You're lounging like a magician, and you got a ridiculous fedora on. <laughs> He's laying on this, on this I, sofa I, behind I, us. I've known you a long time, and I don't mean to sound make this sound hostile. If I could boot you as hard as I could in the fucking noggin right now, I would. Re- I'd like to kick you if under you the could... chin and take your head off. Brian, but if how... you knew that there were no legal ramifications, no, no papers to fill out with no, the cops, do it. would you I, I just wanna take, boot him? I want to take three steps and football. No, because I'll tell punt, you what, dude. Football punch your no. fucking head uh, yeah, off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I'll tell you what. For real. No, because I'll tell you what. If you did that, guess what? I wouldn't file a report. I wouldn't fucking. I wouldn't get you the wouldn't police involved. Oops! Shut up. But what I would do is, I'd just fucking be like, "There, that's what you do. You, that's who you are. What are you're, you? you're a guy who break, who who beats up his friends, and that's bullshit. But you, you wouldn't and be able I make to you talk feel bad. You, and oops! And you oops again. Because I'm talking, and that would be shitty of you. And you'd be a, a fucking again. bad you'd person. Bite Conversation, your off. You'd Conversation bite your strangler, off. Steven. No, don't call me that. Stevens. Yep, that's how you are. Don't Conversation I, Strangler Stevens. I'll By the way, you. Brian, I didn't call it. Chris came up with the nickname. You can't, you can't, you can't, you can't please a woman. I heard. I heard oh, that. me? Yeah. Are you, are you out of your stone? No. When I'm driving hilt deep, <laughs> when I'm driving hilt bristle deep. <laughs> Well, that's not even that deep. When I'm driving bristle deep, and it's not you're that telling deep. me is I it, can't wreck a woman's is it, life, is it bristly because you've shaved it clean for a guy, and then guys, later it's like guys, a week later, and you're yeah. going back to chicks, I don't, and I don't, it's bristly? No, yeah, and it rubs against her yeah. good stuff. No, 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 yeah. Listen, guys, that's what it is. when I'm bristle deep, I've made girls sing, and I'm not joking. <laughs> I'm Brian. not joking. Girls who aren't even musical are like, <laughs> are they falling off a building? <laughs> Hey, listen, Brian, how do you – wait, you know what we should talk about for real, though, what? is uh, how do you actually for real, really for real make love and really? have sex? It depends. You and, want to talk and, about And that? the difference of it, the difference between making love and, and, and having oh, sex. Oh, there's a huge difference. There's I know, and, and, but what is your – what is what are your I'll intricacies you, and nuances? The way the way I make love is, is you know, I, I like to hold a girl – I like to support a girl under her back and her neck, and I'm extremely fucking strong. So one thing I can do are that they, you two awake? fucking twigs can't – Yes, they awake? Yes, they're oh, awake. Oh, okay. I don't know. Is I pick their entire body up off the bed with one arm with them – their spine resting on my forearm and pull them towards my cock. Yeah. And Jesus. you do that while you look in a girl's eyes and oh, she'll, she'll fall in love. I know, but women emit a chemical. Um, I, we know after this. They, all right. Well, anyway, the it point makes is, them love you. Right. Yeah. Right. So when I make love to a woman, I literally create love. I don't say make love. I I say, would you like to create love? Okay, dude. Oh, but that's you, a but complete you know, not, sexual you, turn off. You, you fuck blow up dolls. I'm no. talking about a real human being. <laughs> okay. Like, well, what do you do with your real human being? Yeah. So you, that's making love, though. Yeah. You want to hear how I? Fuck? Yeah. How do you do it? Okay. That? Here's the thing about me. I'm pushing three bills right now, and at 250 <laughs> pounds, I lost like a shit ton of weight like 12 yeah. years ago or something. Yeah. And at 250 pounds, I was eight percent body fat. That mm-hmm. means that that's me with just the that's the fucking Cock Diesel Will Sasso right there. That's just me shredded the That's fuck That's you to your essence? Right, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm, I, at 250 pounds, I'm, 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 I have the same body fat percentage of, of a Roger Federer. Okay, so, so, okay. so you're, you're, you're just, you're so just right all now, alloy, alloy, uh, alloy. Yeah, so like when you look at me alloy now, it's, like, it's hard mm. to believe. I just look like a scaled up version of Roy Jones Jr. painted white. That's, right. um, that's really ridiculous. Yeah, that's what well, I look so like. Don't so compare when I, yourself to these sporting greats. Yeah, it's, so annoying. I, it's annoying. It's so annoying. So when I fuck a 
girl. Right. I'm bringing close to three bills of pressure, and that we're talking. We got to factor in velocity in there, and your nub, and your four inch <laughs> round doorknob <laughs> nub. You're yeah. dis- it's dis- not four inches. You're disappointing. So if I, if I wart riddled if, nub, and also I take a lot of fucking yoga, and I can do a fucking handstand, nah, a headstand. Yes, nah, I can. Nah, I'll, nah, do, you can't. I'll do one right here. I swear to God. And if I hold a chick down by her fucking calves or behind her knees, and get, get, <laughs> bless I'm you. I'm sorry. I'm allergic she to. She sneezes. You're she fucking sneezes. dumb bullshit. Anyway, it's it's hard and rough. Chris, how do you make love? Uh, well, no, Brian, you 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 want to take Brian? I'm sure you can't talk about this for 45 minutes. Well, I I will. I, I, <laughs> Joe, don't don't make fun of me. When I make love, um, that's a personal thing. But um, I, I I've been known. I will ruin a girl for other men. That's that's a given. Um, because I communicate with a woman on a very deep level. Um, she can feel my heartbeat. I can control my breathing and my heart rate and I can, I can, she can feel my heartbeat. But I I think that what I try to do is get, I ride so deep. I ride so deep and girls are always amazed. They have that much, that much. They they have that much of a pussy, so Wait. I, yeah. What? I, I, no no no. I, I do. You I get so places. deep that they're like, oh god, I, got, I didn't know I, got I had a, that I much lay, pussy. I I put a flag up there where none of you guys can even. You can't even get to the entrance of what I get wh- where I break into. I'm on the top of their mountain, if you understand what mm-hmm. I'm saying. So you're, in that sense, they've never been touched. I tickle their belly you, button you, from the inside. You the top of cunt mountain. <laughs> Top of God. Man. By the way, by the way, mountain. Brian, we're cracking your innuendos. We, we're getting them. Okay. You, yeah. you, especially because you started with they didn't know they had that much pussy. <laughs> so when you say I'm at the top Did of I their mountain, pussy? I meant, we know what I you meant, mean. I didn't mean pussy. I meant cunt. Oh no! Oh, don't, don't say, say that. that. No, 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 no. no. Chris. But I say it with love. And when I'm, but Joe Rogan always says if you're if you're making love, you're facing each other. If you're fucking a girl from behind, you're fucking. Yeah. And uh, and and uh, I usually. Um, at that point, I like to grab a fistful of hair. And of your own. And just <laughs> rock out. Own, I like to grab my own hair. <laughs> and I like to, no, I like to, run, I like to actually run my... I like to run my fingers through my hair while I'm looking in the mirror and taking a girl from behind. That's your my sex, favorite your, I have a feeling when you fuck a girl, it's a lot like the George Michael Faith video. <laughs> you know, where he's just like around, rocking out. A lot of locking, spinning around. A lot of and r- white spinning background. back and forth. Yeah, leather um, jacket. Chris, you're the romantic I, jaguar. Yeah. So I've, uh, I can tell you this, man. I've had sex with over six women. And <laughs> I have... Uh, but I've never had sex. I've never done it. It's always right. lovemaking. Even how, if how do you get them to put a strap on, though? How do you no, get them to do that? No, I don't know. I don't know, but how do you... <laughs> listen to me, How man. do you break that listen ice? Like, me, where man. I want to get, I wanna to get me, taken, man. I can take it like what a woman. What I do is... What I do is... I, 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 uh, I imagine while I'm having sex with them, and this is a secret, so please don't tell anybody. Okay. I imagine while I'm making love with them, I am looking in their eyes, and I'm imagining that I'm consuming them. Really? Whether like eating it, them? Where, yeah, eating. Eating, consuming, having them become me, and that's the love I make. Do you know what and I it's a, real. Do you know what I had a girl say to me, and this is not a joke? Chris has the biggest dick ever. I've, <laughs> no. And who was it? Say who no, it was. Oh. I didn't have a girl okay. say that. I had a girl say this to me. We had sex one time. This was a long time ago in Florida. We had sex. She was so hot, and she was young. And we started kissing, and again, and she goes, I just want to, I want to, if you ever wanted to drink someone's blood... And, and see I you went, later. Yeah. See went, ya. I went. Hey, no. we'll catch you later. <laughs> right. Yeah. I went. No, vampire. I haven't. Wow. And she goes. I, I just get so obsessed with somebody. Sometimes I just want to drink their blood. Oh. And she was dead serious. Problems. I'll tell you. There's 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 a girl that I've had sex with a few times. We're we're good friends now. I almost feel like mentioning her name because she'd actually get a kick out of it on the show here. <laughs> but I won't. Go but ahead, I will Angela say Lansbury. This. Go ahead, Angela, Angela Lansbury. Lansbury. Me and Go Angela ahead. Lansbury. Go ahead. Me and Murder She Wrote. <laughs> and uh, one time she said to me. So we're just, we're sitting there laying there post-coital and she said oh my god you almost broke my fucking arm i go is that why you were screaming she goes well yeah that and you know your fucking thing and your nub and, no it's not a nub and no. i said well why didn't you stop she goes because it felt so fucking good so Ooh, that means well, that a girl would risk problem. risk having her fucking big arm problem smacked in Dude, half I you guys i'm not into pain i'm not into pain no, one time like one time a girl tried to scratch my chest i took her arms down i put it down i said you don't ever do that again, like right. that. It's not very romantic. No, I no, but it was lovemaking, and that's when I stopped it. I had another girl punch me in the face once. No, she no. punched Are me you in the face. Right now? Punched me in the face. Really? It hurt so bad because I, because <laughs> you don't expect it coming. You know what I mean? No. I got up. I said, "Hey, hey, <laughs> if you ever do that again," I said, real calm. I said, "If you ever do that again, you will never see me." And that's then good. I went to, I commenced to lovemaking. 
but I it had, was really this is, this is a up. true story. I had a girl, I was having sex. She and was, it was Angela she goes, Lansbury. She goes, hit me. Oh, I was having sex with a girl, she goes, hit me. And I went, I went, what? She goes, hit me. So I, I, I awkwardly smacked her in the face. And she goes, ow, not in the face. Oh. And I was like, but we're doing a missionary. Oh, my Where'd God. you want me to hit you? Like in the thigh? She wanted, punch, she wanted you to punch him. She wanted, he wanted you to punch him in the shoulder and go, way to go, he, buddy. What he? No, dude. Well, no, don't. Thanks think, for no. listening to the yeah. 10 Minute Podcast. Thanks for subscribing and downloading on iTunes. We are on Stitcher Smart Radio, Twitter at 10 Min Pod, Facebook slash 10 Min Pod. Yeah. And uh, hey, at Angela, Angela Lansbury. I'm sorry for almost breaking your arm, but my dick's the size of your fucking old ass arm. I'm waiting for someone to like ruin their career by just vining themselves taking a huge shit. Oh, God. Just like a close up of their asshole. Uh, Like Amanda Bynes or something. Right. You know? Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. That's why you listen. I don't know if Amanda Bynes is on Vine yet, but are you okay? Yeah. Yep. Yep. I think All so. right. Uh, okay. Welcome to the Ten Minute Podcast. Yep. You want to buy something on Amazon? Go through TenMinutePodcast dot com and Gamefly. 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 Um, my name is Will Sasso. I'm Brian the Kid. Callan. Uh, Chris D'Elia is not with us today. He's off doing whatever the fuck. And um, uh, Brian, are you okay? What's going on? You, you've huh? been you've been fidgeting, and, and since you walked in here, I know I'm embarrassed. I don't want to talk about it. What's going <laughs> Let's on? Let's talk about something else. Um, What's going on? Huh? Did you have too much caffeine? You're kind of you're kind of swir- you're squirming in your chair a little uh, bit. It's too embarrassing to talk about on the air. I don't know what's going on with things. I, I, with I, things, I'm having some issues. What kind of issues? This is a perfect. Having, uh, this is a forum to talk about it. We we've got your audience. They love you. They want to. <laughs> what? Listen, this is you. <laughs> like, I know what is I'm, that? In, I'm not very comfortable right now. So what's the problem? <clears throat> Gee, Brian, are you uh, okay? What's going yeah, on? Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. no. I, I'm, I, every time I move it kills me I'm, what, I'm, what's going on what is the problem i have uh I, I don't know what they are that's like blisters or something down downstairs here and i'm what I know. are you talking about downstairs you're talking about my uh, your dick to be to use the medical yeah, term i need it on my balls i got something you got blisters on. on your dick and balls I don't bro know they're blisters they're just these red fucking big red fucking things like lots of red what's going what okay blisters. wait let's let's go let's go back a little bit you you've been you kind of been and I don't want to start at the very center, at the very core, but that's where problems start in, mm. in our core, in our center, Brian. You've been kind of bouncing off the walls lately. I know. Yeah, and now you sound like a jackal. Like I got to go to the doctor. I got to the doctor. You haven't gone to the doctor? I haven't gone to the doctor. I don't know what the fuck to do about this. Do you know shit. how this happened? Yeah, I was. I, I'm hoping it's not a fucking venereal disease. Well, okay, it is. Okay, it's you don't know be. for sure if it is. I don't, but it obviously is. I start wearing a condom and I'm fucking. You're not wearing a condom. You know, my wife is gonna be. Your so wife is gonna kill you. I know. I what know. What are you I doing? Know, you got a wife and children. Yeah, but you say I know, but you don't know. I feel bad, but I'm. Yeah, but that doesn't matter. You this, have to be accountable. You can't I'm just I'm embarrassed by it. Yeah, but it doesn't she's matter. She's gonna be so fucking mad. At she's me. gonna be really mad. You don't just say I'm embarrassed. You're gonna be accountable. Super white. Country girl was such a slut, and I didn't have any. Where were you? Were you on the road? I was in Hay. <laughs> what? So, you were in know. Hay? Yeah, and we were in Hay. She was a country girl. Where was? Where? Where? I don't even know. I was so fucking drunk. Were you drunk in the and, Dakotas? And, and were you vacationing? Up. I was coked up and drunk out of my mind. Where and, the fuck were you? Uh, we're in LA. I where did you, you find have a... any ice or anything? Yes, there? there's ice oh, upstairs. I'm the... Can I? What do you? I'm gonna let this thing. Out. No, 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 no. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Hold on a second. So you hooked up with some country girl. I don't think that's. I don't think it's connected. I feel guilty enough about that. I well, mean, I, I assure you, your guilt is not manifesting these problems. It sounds like a real physical. Well, problem. Well, sometimes it can be karma. I don't know. You know, I don't know what all to right, do about. Let it. me. All right. All right. Look. Uh, not a lot of people know this, but I was I was pre med before I delved into you acting. Were? Yeah. Which is weird because, you know, I started acting on television and film on screen when I was 15 years old. So I was, I was like 13, 14. Okay, it was kind of a it. doogie so house thing. annoying when you say that. Yeah, well, I was in Canada. I kind of finished school early. Okay, but you so. say it every podcast. We get it. I was like, oh, what am I going to, you know, what am I going to move ah, on to now? All right, you know, Brian, let's just. Oh, that hurt. That one really Let's see it. That really hurt. Let's see huh? it. Let's see it. I don't want to show it to come you. Come on, dude. just, come on, man. We're friends. You're whipping it's it out pretty, all the time. Bro. It's not I know. I've seen the fucking thing, but. No, but oh, you mean the the blisters? Yeah, I, Let's I, see it. It's private. That's a private matter. Yeah, that's why they call them privates. Let's see your dick. Oh, All right, don't freak out. Okay, I'm not gonna freak out. Promise you won't make fun of me. I, 
I will probably. I gotta not get air anyway. Like, I'm fucking okay. dying over okay. here. Oh, hold on. Okay. Oh! Oh, look at! Oh my God! There's bees! Yeah. Oh, there's bees everywhere! Brian, what the heck's going on with this? That's Gee, what Wiz. I mean. Yeah, but she's a country girl. That, 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 there's bees swarming all over the place. I know. They're all there's bees swarming on your dick. You have bee stings. Yeah, put it away. Put it away. Well, the bees all went away. I know. The bees all went in your pants. They won't leave my pants. They will Brian. not leave my pants. Brian, you have a you have a. <laughs> I fucking tell me about your it. Your shorts dude. are full of bees, no man. No shit, dude. And you tell me this isn't karma for being a scumbag. <laughs> fucking embarrassed, bro. <laughs> oh, jeez. I know. Oh, uh, Brian, that's, that's queen, disgusting. And there's a queen down here somewhere. And every are time I try to extract Wait, it, they the sting queen. my fucking hand. Let's see the queen. She's big and she's right under my dick. Okay, let's see the. She's queen. nestled between my 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 fucking my sack and let's my see. dick. The base of a dick. All right. Uh, All right. Oh, here's the bees. Yeah, the bees. Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah. Oh, 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 she's huge. Ah, oh, jeez. They're all. Oh, they're putting. They're building a honeycomb for. Oh, okay. Put it back in. Oh man, it's unbelievable how all the bees go inside when you do that. I know because they won't leave the queen. So I've got to either get somebody to move, remove the queen, right, and then the rest will follow. But right. if I don't get the queen out from below my shaft, I'm, I'm, you're fucked. Just, I'm fucked. And Brian, keep, this is the soldiers keep stinging my shaft every time I move around. Go to the doctor. What's go a to doctor the, gonna do? Gonna get rid of these bees in your pants? How? With with penicillin? I got to do something about that. Yes, with penicillin. Probably one uh, shot. Fuck. What do you mean fuck? Uh, okay, man. After this, we're going to the uh, ER. Fucking okay? country girl. <laughs> don't blame the girl. She's Rich. Well, what's okay? So alabaster white. It's so gross. She did she was have so like fucking white? She was a, almost an albino. Did she have like a big bushy red? Oh, she uh, was a giant. She was so much bigger than me. She was literally like a milk. She was a milk fiend. She what just she? drank milk the whole time. She lived on milk. Yeah, she's got and a, wheat. She's a different ecosystem. That girl unto herself. I swear that's to God, not, she that's had not a someone... size fourteen foot. She was ah, the biggest oh girl. My God, her head that's... was giant. Oh man, you don't Big stick hands. your dick in that. I know, Big hands? dude. Tell me about it. I'm an asshole, and I'm married with kids. How do you think I felt when I was doing it? What did she smell like? I bet oh, she smelled awful. God, she smelled like milk. Oh, she smelled like milk, like yeah. fresh milk, or just milk and wheat. Oh man. And probably like rotten, like no, sour milk. No, don't be gross, dude. I'm not being gross. You just said she had size 14 <sighs> feet. Oh, okay. Pull. All right, let's try to get rid of some of these. Can pull you it get... out. Will you please just pull the queen out, please? Okay. Hold on. Ah. Let me see if I can pull the... Get it. Okay, uh, hold on. Careful, you're going to get stung. Uh, ah, it stung me. I'm sorry, sir. I think they're Africanized. Ah, no, I'm putting it back in. I think they're Africanized. Yeah, they're African. I'm putting the queen back into your pants. Ah, okay, close your pants. Close your pants. Oh, jeez. Oh. <laughs> and I just got stung by the I'm sorry. the queen venereal. Do you have a fucking puss bee from you, that country girl, dude? Do you? I caught bees from that girl. I can't believe I caught cunt bees from that girl. Brian, you have cunt bees. <laughs> I have cunt bees. Brian, you have. So Brian, you have. How do I explain this to my girl? She's gonna you fucking cunt. kill me. Oh, there's I no think, way to hide cunt well, bees. Look, no, there is no way to hide cunt bees, man. You gotta. <laughs> You gotta. Here's what you gotta do. What? what you gotta. You gotta. You, you gotta go. I'm so worried All right. about this. I okay. Worried. Don't I'm calm worried. down, man. I'm waiting so much pain right now. Okay. Stop. Pain right now. And I am gonna be. <laughs> you and sound. No way. Don't. I, not a no lot of people know this, but Brian <laughs> Callen sounds like Jennifer Tilly when he cries. Okay, <laughs> Brian. Don't. <laughs> don't do it on the podcast. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. You sound. <laughs> you sound like a squeaky. You sound like a squeaky wheel. Stop it. All right, Brian. Here's what we're gonna do. First, we're gonna go. First, we're gonna go to the ER. Okay. First, we're gonna go. The, well, actually, first what we're going to do is we're going to go out to the driveway. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to siphon some gasoline from my truck. Okay. We're going to pour it on your dick. And what? We're going to burn your dick for no! about... No! Just about two or three minutes. Safe. And then And then we're going to go to the ER. Ah, we're going to take care of that. There's I probably going to be a little bit more grafts. blistering. Yeah, we're probably no. going to have to do a skin graft from the inside of your forearm or probably There's your thigh. There's got to be a better way to get rid of cunt beats. And then we're going to go We're going to go to your home. Wait, hold and on. And you're going to no. say... No, you're going to say to your gal, <laughs> straight up, here's what you're going to say. What? Here, okay, repeat after me. Yeah. Okay, here's, here's what we're going to do, just as yeah. a practice. <laughs> Honey? Yeah, honey. I love you. Uh, I love you and I'm so sorry. No, no, no. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. Repeat after me. Honey, I love you. Honey, I love you. I have cunt bees. I I can't say it. Say I have cunt bees, Brian. I can't say it. Brian, say I have cunt bees. I have cunt bees. And that's that simple, man. Don't cry. You have cunt bees, man. Why don't we ask our listeners if somebody out there knows how to get rid of cunt bees? I know there's got to be somebody who's a bee person. If anybody knows how to 
Get rid of cunt bees. Please tweet us at Ten Min Pod. I gotta let it out again. I you can leave. okay. Let it let him out. Let it air out. Just try the fucking trees. I'm not to swat, the just, oh, look trying at to get the bees. Queen. I know, so many bees. All right, just leave them out. Leave them out. Just leave them out for the. Leave them out. Leave air it out. We're gonna go outside. We're gonna get, we're gonna gas those fuckers. We're gonna burn it. Yeah, but how are we gonna do that? It's gonna really hurt my dick even more. Don't hurt. Yeah, it's gonna hurt. Can't you just take the queen and, and put her somewhere? No, just you... get, keep look. Keep get the keep queen. Don't let her near me. She's stuck. Uh, put the queen under your dick I'm between your dick it. and ball. No, no, no. Leave it out. Hey, thanks for listening to Ten Minute Podcast. We're on Twitter, Ten Minute Pod, Facebook slash Ten Minute Pod. Uh, follow us on Vine. Follow all of our vines. And uh, thanks for subscribing and downloading on iTunes if you haven't already. We're on Stitcher Smart Radio. And, br- and pray for Brian's cunt bees. Hashtag cunt bees. Okay, so, but it doesn't look like the sea. Yeah, it does. Your your sweatshirt looks like the sea. And no, guess it what's doesn't. Awesome? And it's it says, a hoodie, not a sweatshirt. It's a denim supply. Ralph it's a, Loren. Yeah, Ralph Loren. You, you ever heard of Ralph Loren? A couple times. Some podcasts are slow. And you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to This is this was a purchase I bur- I bought this I bought this in Dallas, okay. You, you know it should stay it's in Dallas. Good, no, it no you it should. You got it off a rack somewhere. Where nobody wanted. No, I didn't. It. I got it in the fucking Macy's or whatever, and it, I looked at it, and, it's, and and let me tell you something. As yeah. soon as I looked at it, I'll have you know, I I was with Brent Morin, yeah, and and, and another comedian, and I went, oh shit. Well, I want I the sky. I want somebody. No. They but it looks kind of Zubaz tie dyed. It's great. It's got a little I, bit of. I'm a, I'm I'm sort of media. I don't care about it. But it's because you don't know how to dress. No, I'm wearing a hoodie and you're wearing a hoodie, yeah. Brian. Mine's black. Yours is gray. He's his looks like something that wavy like, gravy would yeah. wear. You know what I got? 69. No, you know what I got? Maybe maybe I got a little bit of style, guys. No. All right, hey, you, maybe you, maybe I got a little bit of style. Maybe that's I, what you see. That looks like a lava lamp, like the inside of a lava lamp. All right, everybody. Brian hates Chris's hoodie. Welcome to the Ten Minute Podcast. Here's the thing. Go to uh, 10 and hit the Amazon banner, but uh, re-bookmark that because we got it going to new things. You'll buy whatever the fuck you want, and we'll get a little kickback, and there's the all that stuff. Gamefly. My name um, is my name is Will Sasso. My name is Brian the Kid Callen. I'm going to be in uh, no, uh, Sacramento. No. Okay, hold on. <laughs> November 7th, 8th, 9th, and in Park City. <laughs> but why, guys, do mine? November 29th and 30th. Can and I, do I want mine? to thank you guys I'm for cr- buying your tickets <laughs> already. Excuse me. Excuse ahead me. of time, the way you probably have in storming, excuse me, storming that website. Hey, Brian, thank you so much for okay. buying Brian's not even looking at Brian, this. Brian Countdown, B R I A N C A L L E N. It's B R I A N. Thank you. Now hit there. Now, not God damn it, B R Y A N C A L L E N. I'm Chris D'Elia, and I'll be I'll be in Atlanta. So just go fucking you do the math up there. Let me ask you a question. Really? Let me ask you. Oh, you want to ask me a question? Where have you been? What do you mean? Where have you been? I've been fucking in L A. I've been. Uh, You've been LA. here, okay. Okay, cool. but I've been on the road too. I was in New York and Miami, but why? Don't say wait. What? Don't say Did you that. say Miami? No. no, I was in New York and Miami. Yeah. No, no, no. Don't say Miami or Miami. No, no, no. I, I, it's Miami. Okay, well, just how, when's the last time you went to Miami? Yeah, have you been? You've been. I've been. been. Yeah, it's been, been about there. a year. You've never been. Oh, you've it's been. been a, it's been about. It's and actually been two been. years. I've been there many times. It's been two years. Oh, okay. So then you know how it talks about you, Cubano, but. Okay. No, 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 no. You're not Cubano. No, no. I know I'm not Cubano, but I'm just saying to show respect to be like Miami. You know? Okay, you're not. You're it's, not it's Fat not, Joe or right. or fucking no, Pitbull. I'm or... not either of them. I'm not anybody like that. You don't have a really tight pair of pink slacks and sunglasses at night For, and sunglasses further, at night and a white sport coat. Furthermore, he needs to know Talking that to the Miami mic. is my house. All right, you guys are. Can I explain something? You guys are kind of in on each other right away. You're, you're digging in. Well, and the last the last episode we had was on Thursday. Mm-hmm. Brian, you were not here. You right. were in a car accident, or you were driving by one. Yeah. Chris and I recorded without you. Yeah. You know, everyone heard yeah. you coming in via the phone, and you had some choice things to say for Chris. And now, you know, as far as peeling back the layers goes, hey everybody, it's now a few minutes later. Brian's walked through the door. Mm-hmm. And you're very upset with Chris. Well, why? Well, well, I'll tell you why. I thought we were friends. You are friends. One. We are friends. Are look we? at him. Oh, you're we are? one of my best friends. Oh, we're friends? friends? You're you're lo- wanna... Why are you looking at me? Because I'd rather look at you right you're now. You're doing that thing you're where you're looking of... at me. No, I'm at, may I ask a question? Yeah, I, you know what I am? I'm simply confused. <laughs> okay. Well, That's what, all. Going on? Am I allowed to be confused? Sure. Yeah, what are you confused, confused about? What I'm confused yeah. about is that for whatever reason, I don't get texts from Chris. What are you but, talking about? Okay, Apparently, but, but can I've you been look ignored. At, but you, and, no, I'm, and I'm going to tell you what I think is going on. Do you mind Why if aren't I you give, looking at him? Do you mind if I give my theory yeah. about what I think is going on? What is if that? If I'm allowed, am I allowed? Yeah. Yeah, can oh, you relax okay. though? Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah. I think Chris is one of those fair weather friends right. who's got a now he's got a new friend. He's got a new <laughs> who's his, friend. Who's his new and friend? And Brian gets kicked to the fucking curb and I'll tell you something else. Curve. I've What's heard that? some things. Hmm, I've heard some things. What have you heard? I've heard some things and he's been hanging out Stop doing with, that a, with, with your... a new dude. <laughs> a new dude. Yeah, how's your new dude? Bro? What are you How's your new dude? Okay, okay hold first on. of all, can hold I say on. can I say this, Chris, before you go, can I just say Brian, please look at Chris, you're not going to be able to get through to him. You're not going to be able to repair the friendship, which I don't even think is broken. Won't. Okay, please go right. to Ten Minute Pod or go to our Twitter at Ten Minute Pod, Facebook slash Ten Minute Pod to see a picture of Brian refusing to look at Chris. Okay, you're why trying to I, connect why would to Chris. I look at him. I'm, All right, Chris. I'm asking you, know what? you, you know, a question. No, no, you know what? Don't, why would I don't, ask him? I'm, don't look at me. I am okay? looking. I'll look. Don't, don't I'll look, look at you. You're not looking at Will. Him. No, there it is. I look. No, you didn't. But Will, you didn't. You looked side. You looked at my coffee. Now, Will. Yeah, fine. you can just tell Brian. I know what you look like. Okay, I don't have to I'll look at you. All right, fine. Uh, you obviously know what I look like because I'm striking, and you have that image in your head from last time. No, you you have a stupid structure. Uh, well, okay, uh, let me just. Can I just address who, this? Who are you hanging can out I, with? Can I? But what? who are you hanging out with? All right. I I can I get an answer? Yeah, Jeez. man. Wait, what is this? Who is this new dude that you see? What seem is to the be, new What are you dude? talking about? There's hey. no new dude. Okay. Am okay. I the new? Can dude? Can I just say? Dude, even like, can I just say? Let Chris say first something. of all, yeah. I have yeah. no, I have no new friends right now. You okay? don't? No. You I, don't? I haven't made a new friend in a while. You okay. don't? All Brian, the, all who the did you go to the movies with? Because I heard some things. Weren't you at the movies with new dude? Weren't you at the movies with new dude? Your silence and hesitation is colossally interesting to me okay. right now. Well, it's stop. very interesting. Right. Okay. Well, Brian, you're not yeah. really giving me chances to talk. Okay. Please do. It sounds like you're hesitating. Brian, well, I've been busy. I've been working. I'm doing a TV show. Hanging out with new no, dude. Can I, can, I, can, I, can I finish? Brian, yeah. not for nothing. You're sort of conversation strangler. Okay. You're strangling the con- right. conversation. You're conversation strangler Stevens. Go ahead. You're being, you're being Stevens. All right. If, whether your first name's Brian with an I or a Y, you're definitely your it's last name's Stevens. With a Y. It's with an I. Well, you're Brian Fucking, Stevens it's a right y. now. Stop so, being Brian Stevens. Yeah, don't be Mr. Stevens. So look, man. I don't... I don't. I haven't had a new friend in a while. Okay, and not by choice, not by anything other than I've just been really busy, yeah. and I don't know what you've been hearing. Okay, but furthermore, if I want to have, if I meet a new d- dude and I want to hang out with him, mm. then whatever. Mm. Why is that bad? Has he been to your house, Brian? There isn't a guy. Has he been to your house? Has he been to your pool? N- no. It's October. Who? Were you? Who did you go to the movies with? It's a simple question. I don't uh, care. I don't Tell know, me. man. I don't give a shit. Well, well, first of all, who'd you hear this from? I I have a lot of friends in the comedy world, bro, and I have a lot of friends in L.A. Yeah, but and why guess are you, what, why bro? You... They see you. Yeah, but okay. <laughs> they why you... see you. Why are you trying to right. take ownership over Chris and how yeah, he spends his, his I mean, social I time? I hang out with Will sometimes. I just yeah. think it's interesting that I've been obviously. Kicked to okay. the fucking. So, right, what, what, have I been ignoring you? Have I been ignoring you? I've been you? booted into the dirt for something. You said you weren't. He, you said he wasn't responding to your texts. He doesn't know. I don't text. I, text, am, I don't text. get texts. Hmm. Texas. 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 The Texas. Texas. I don't get anything. I don't. I did. I actually thought he was dead. No, that's not true. Well, that's not true. Because well, yes, you, I did. I actually. You follow me on Vine to learn. And and you that's, know I that's I've been super mine. condescending and will you better fucking come to my defense because I see what you're doing. Okay, now you're what if I did? It's kind of funny what yeah. he said, but Chris, well, people don't don't do that thing where people are like, hey, what are you doing right now? It's like, well, didn't you see my tweet? Yeah. Didn't you see my vine? Yeah, don't yeah. do that. I Instagrammed it. Okay, but, I mean, but if don't. I do all three, then obviously you know you caught one. Yeah, I, but some people aren't on their phone, Chris. They're not going to see that. Right? I know, but maybe, I, they're, maybe they heard from another guy or whatever. Like someone said, oh, hey, look at Chris's vine. Yeah, Chris is at the movie theater. Yeah, maybe he's watching Gravity with so and so. Did you go to oh oh so you know something what's going on no so I'm you just, know what's going on no i think no, that was, I, so I, so this is very interesting i think that was no, you know what that is that's called a fucking slip bro don't that's a slip bro it, it's not that's not actually a technical that's what term it is. for anything so right. i'm being lied to all right well, no, brian, and i'm glad if anything this. brian this you, is how friends are not supposed all right to look be. brian chris and i live near each other you live all the way the fuck out near the ocean you not an excuse detroit not an excuse and sometimes you know Chris wants to go to a movie. He calls me. I'm not around. So someone wants to go to a movie. Who, yeah. who is the new dude? Answer the question. Or I will find out and I'll beat the fucking shit out of that guy. And it's going to be really funny when I'm punting his head into the fucking curb. That's actually not funny at all. And you're pee popping. What have you done with the guy? 
He sure hasn't done any podcasts your, with Your him. silence is amazing. He hasn't done any podcasts. What do you mean, what have I done with him? Like, what things have we done hanging out-wise? So you admit there's a guy. You admit there's a new friend. I don't know what you're saying new. new what's new? Oh, oh your head. Oh, I don't know. I'm confused now. What does it matter, I'm man? I'm confused. Who is your new friend that, that, that you're ignoring me for? If you don't tell me, I'm gonna flip the fuck out on Calm you. Calm down, man. I'll flip the fuck okay. out. Okay. You wanna fight? Tim. Tim! Ah! Thank you! We have a how, name! How do you know who Tim is? What does Tim. Tim do? And what's he look like? Tim's a. He's tall, I know that. I got that description. He's a writer. He's a tall writer. Oh, he's a writer now. Chris is, is doing a bunch a of stuff. He's got writer. people he meets. We're is working on. Whoa, well, hold on. Who the fuck? Excuse me. I'm not talking to you. All right. You've been you talking to me half me. the time. You're not even looking but at me. But you're a liar. So now All right. I'm not Thanks looking for listening to the 10 Minute Podcast. Please tell one friend, even if it's Tim, about the show, and we'll call we'll Tim. keep it going. I'm going to call Tim. What? I'm going to call Tim. Hey, man. Where is he? How's it going? What, Chris? Yeah. Who cares? Let's just do it without him. Ah, it's so obnoxious. Did he text you at or anything? Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. Welcome to the 10 Minute Podcast. If you're going to buy something on Amazon, what you do is you go to 10minutepodcast.com. So you started well. And then, and then you hit the energy. Amazon button. You're losing energy. One third of us isn't here. No, I don't care. My name is Will Gladiator Helmet Face, the White Samoan no, Hulk. that's so long. And it's such a long nickname, Chief bro. Engineer of Laughter and Cheer, Sasso. You know, it makes... What's it, your name? What's your name, dude? Brian the Kid Callan. I Crystal just... is not here. Uh, should be here any second, and yeah. um, or we hope. Uh, but we've just decided to go on without him because you Let's know do it. we Let's got a bunch of episodes down. without we don't need you him. recently. Um, here and there, so we don't need him. We can lay one down. All right, so go for it. Well, how are you doing, Brian? Uh, what would you like to talk about, Brian? Crushing it. Yeah, you're crushing it. I'm crushing it. <laughs> okay, and, I would expect I mean, no less. You, yeah, you, you seem yeah. to say that a lot, no matter what. Is that a front? You fronting? Yeah? You got pra? I, I do have some auditions, and I think I'm going to get them. And I, I think this is the year that I really I, don't I say break. That. Yeah, don't say that. Don't say that. Oh, look, he's calling. Hold on. Hey, he's stuck in traffic. Oh, oh, hey, hey, get oh. here. Get here for sure. For oh. sure, get here. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, yeah. Let's put him on. I bet he's on the five. Uh, hey. Hey. Chris? Where are you? Hey, can you guys hear me? Yeah, we can hear yeah, you. What's up? Hear, when what's uh, up? Were you getting here? We already started. Hold on, hold on. Shh, 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 shh. Hold on. Shh. What's going on? Shh, for a second. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Got Why it. do we have to shush? We're doing the podcast. I know, I know. Where are you, bro? I, okay, it, it's a long explanation. Okay? What? Okay. Are you all right? It was a long explanation. Yeah, but I have to be kind of a little bit quiet, okay? Okay, so give us the explanation. So, listen. So I'm, I got I got myself into a little bit of a conundrum. <laughs> you okay. Know to say. All right. All right. So, um, I, I, I got, hold on. Shh, shh, wait, hold on one second. What, what are you some, doing? Some, something's up. Something's no. Well, okay. But, but Chris would never use the word conundrum. Yeah. Right. Wasn't okay. Yeah, I've never heard right. him use that word. What? Are you, what's? Right. Where are you? What are you doing? Well, because I have to wait for the guard to go. I have to wait guard. For the guard to Chris, pass. the guard, or the car. Yeah. A guard. A car? Like your car? Guard. Is he's, your car? Draw, he's drawing out the A, a longer than he should. Is your car in the shop? Or it's the pronounced wash? guard, not guard. Brian, back off okay, the so fucking mic. I, I thought I would take a little trip. You know, Scott's been getting to me. Um, and I had a, a, a job to do. Uh, I had a job to do. Uh, a stand up job in uh, overseas. It's a what I job? Got, yeah, what? I, I, got, I had a job to do over overseas. Where? You know, where? Where overseas? You what kind like, of job? You mean where? like a stand-up gig? Yeah, exactly. I got paid this to go do a gig in, in Paris. You know? Yeah, and, and you're in Paris right now? I'm, I was supposed to go to Paris, but in the middle of it, we kind of I got rerouted. I to, got in a lot of trouble. To where? Where's, where'd you get rerouted? Talk, talk. You're not making any sense. Vietnam. Vietnam? You're in, you're in Vietnam right now? Are you? Hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Shh, shh, hold wait, on. Shh, wait, shh, just listen. listen. All right. Okay, what's up? Are you in trouble? I'm in a little bit of trouble, yeah. I'm in Vietnam. I got captured, 
just, I, hold I, on, hold on. Captured, you got captured? Where, captured are you, where, are, where, where are you in Vietnam? What area of Vietnam? Uh, the, the, what's Viet Cong? What's are you on me? Are you on? Are you on? A, are you near water? Yes, I'm definitely near water. Okay, do, yes. are you are you near the Mekong Delta? Brian. The, yes. The, don't say Mekong Delta just because to sound I cool. know Vietnam. No, you don't know Vietnam. Chris is actually sounds like he's actually. In are trouble. you near a river? Chris, look. But, hold on. Let me handle it. No, I'm going to handle it. Chris, we're going to call the embassy and we're going to get you out of Vietnam. The embassy's not going to help you, Will. What are you talking about? If the he's, embassy's if he's not going to help you because if he's caught, if he's been captured by, by by fucking river pirates, it's a it's a major problem. Chris, just this, are they river pirates? Problem. Chris, this did, is a major fucking problem. All right, because I got shh, hold on. Okay, because I got. I got these guys, these Vietnamese guys with guns, and they trap me, and I'm behind bars right now, and I was in a boat, and now I'm just talking oh, you fuck. the Mekong. You were in a, you were in a, a boat in the yes, Mekong Delta. Yes, 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 wait, yes. Bro, wait, Chris, are yes. you telling, wait, Chris, are you telling us to shush or someone over there? Uh, shush. One second. Hold on one second, guys. Yeah. Okay, Brian, over there. We'll meet you back at the, at the bar. Bye-bye. Wait, wait, wait hold wait, on, wait, hold wait, on. Wait, whoa, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What was that? On. What was that? What is it? What was that? Is he calling your phone? I, yeah, I, wait, that, no, what, that's why, actually you, a good you have your phone on you and you're calling from Vietnam? Yeah, I thought you were calling from your car. You're caught in traffic. Yeah. This is your phone no, number. No, no, no. Listen to me. I know because I'm crafty. Do you know how I'm crafty? Wow. Okay, so so basically what I did was when they first came, when the Miklos Vargas, when the Miklos Vietnam guys came up. The to Mekong me, River Pirates. Yeah, you're saying Miklos, like my friends Johan and Miklos yeah, who I go hiking with in Topanga. Whatever the Viet Cong guys were. No, the, the river pirates. They're very thorough. They, they would take your phone. Why did they not take the, your phone? No, 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 no. Because when I first saw them, I put my phone in my anus. That's the first place they check, bro. That's yeah, not that's, that's a lie. They're going up there for You're other reasons. You're not hiding a phone Brian. in your anus, bro. Brian, like Brian says, these are these are these are pirates. They're, they're river pirates. Yeah, they're okay. they're different. They're fucked up. They're gonna they're gonna. They, you to you're lucky that you're not you filleted right now. Right now. Yeah. Can you listen? To, can you listen to me? Of course. I put the phone in my anus, and okay. these pirates didn't check it. Sure. And now I'm talking on the phone. There's a little bit of shit on my face. Okay, listen to me. Dude. Okay, hold on. What that? Okay. What do they but want from you? But that's small potatoes. But that's small potatoes compared to what these fucking guys do. What do they want from you? They were, they were, they were really, they really wanted my jewelry. One second. You, you don't, don't wear jewelry. You don't wear jewelry. I know. I, 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 I didn't wear jewelry, which is why they took me captive and i've got talking on the phone why do you keep telling us to hold are you telling us to hold on for a second or someone else there's a little bit of shit in my eyes there's okay well clean your eyes out can you get some water do you have a swab he's gonna get dengue fever out there brian of course he is he's fucked around 9 30 are you drinking are you drinking wait 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 what what did you say did you say meet someone at the beach at 9 30 huh chris where are you did you say you said you're gonna meet someone at the beach at 9 30 I'm in a lot of trouble. I got shit all over my mouth and eyes. And well, now, hold on, hold you're... on. You had a little bit of shit on your face. Now it's on your, in your eyes and all over your mouth. What's, you're, you're, you keep changing your story. Okay, okay wait. If on. you are indeed being held captive by Vietnamese oh, river pirates, Brian, Brian, you let would me not have this. your Brian, fucking phone. All right, okay, calm down, Brian. I don't Chris, believe the guy. Chris, listen to me. On our friendship, are you in Vietnam right now? Ah, uh, Chris. I, I fucking knew Chris, it. Where, where, are where are you? Fuck, dude? Where man. Are you? Where are you? I'm, I'm in, I'm, I'm in Hawaii. Hawa- Hawaii. Where in Hawaii? Hold on. Where in Hawaii? I'm in the I'm Maui. It's one of the you know medium-sized islands. What yeah, island? We know which island. Yeah, what island? Maui. Brian. You just you said just, Maui. Okay. Whatever. Where, where in Maui? It doesn't matter where he is. It does because, no, it doesn't believe- because he's on vacation. I don't believe him. He He's should on have been. Vacation. He just wanted. He was supposed to be here. What, 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 when did you get I, on a plane? I am on vacation, dude. And I was. I don't know. I thought I wanted you guys to think I was cool and in some trouble and shit. You guys are always talk about how I eat mustard sandwiches. Oh Christ! Well, we don't mean that you yeah. mean mu- eat mustard you don't sandwiches, have to prove dude. Shit to I haven't us. eaten one mustard sandwich. No, nobody would eat just a mustard sandwich, right. Chris. Of and course, I don't do that. Right, okay, well, but you don't have to pretend. Be in Hawaii, you don't huh? have to pretend that you're going to Vietnam right. and getting captured. Right. If you want to go to Hawaii, to go to Hawaii. That, Hawaii. Just to say that you, you're not eating mustard right. sandwiches. And go, if you want to go to Hawaii, right. go to fucking right. Hawaii. It's a free country. But tell us. Yeah, exactly. But tell us. I'm in Oahu or, or a Maui, and so I'm saying that. Hold on. You just said you were in Maui. Yeah, I'm in Maui. You just, I'm in one of the medium-sized islands. I got it mixed up with Oahu. I'm sorry. All right. So fucking. Who's there? Me. Who's there with you? Yeah, who's, who's there with you? Yeah. I got a few girl, girls. And, put them on the phone. Uh, take put, a picture right now. Put them now. on the phone. No, no. no, no. Take no, a picture on, of Brian, you. Brian, shut your trap. Well, 
Put them on the well, phone right now. Will, Will, I would, but I, I just told them I would meet them at the beach, so they're not here now. Take a picture of the beach right Take now. Take a picture of the beach. Take a picture of right now. Take a picture of the beach. Send it to us. I would, I would, but my phone is, it never works like that. That's, you, know. you send pictures all the time. Okay, Chris, I'm now I'm going to have to fucking ask you. Are you, this is fucking, he's, he's crazy. On our friendship. He's out of his mind. Are you, are you in Hawaii or not? No. He's Damn not, it. he's not in Hawaii. Damn it. Where no. are you? Where are you, dude? I'm in my, I'm in my house. Of course you are. What are you, well then, what is this? What the fuck is the problem? Why, Why would you, you lie, do this? Why man? would you do this to us? Yeah, I was worried. Because, man, I wanted you to think that I was ca- captured by the, me- me- what was it? Viet Cong. The, the river pirates in the Mekong Delta. Oh yeah, the Viet, whatever. And then when that, I realized that that was not cool. And then I was, I was trying to make you think I was cool. But then I realized when I said I had shit all over my eyes and mouth, that that's not cool. So I figured I would just come clean and say I was on vacation in Hawaii. But I wasn't. You're welcome. For, for what? For what? Well, yeah. No. You're welcome. Who, us? No, it's you, very you. obnoxious. Some podcasts are slow, and you don't know how long they last. That's why you're listening to 10 Minute Podcast. Uh, 2014 coming to an end here. That's right. Um, and I just... You know, we all did our things. We've come a long way, haven't we? Collectively, but also individually. But yes. What, and, what and, was and, the your welcome thing? Uh, uh, well, I mean, I don't know. I Why guess, do you seem so perplexed by my question? I don't well, no, you, to... I feel like you're winding up right now, and this is how you wind up. So I'm what, calm. Okay, no, but I see you winding up well, to say something so, like look, self-congratulatory. So what, me, well, I, why, why are you welcome? We didn't say thank you, so do you, don't you think that's a bit adversarial but and obnoxious? It started the the podcast started, and then I said you're welcome. So the listeners, I'm going to tell the listeners that you did say thank you right before we started. Recording. I didn't say thank you. Did well, you say thank you? No, I didn't. Well, but, but they're going to believe they're who they're going to believe. Gonna believe, believe. Yeah. Look, let me tell you something. This is uh, because we know Chris so well, we know each other so well. I kind of I'm reading your paper, I'm picking up what you're laying down, and I think I know what you're trying to say, Chris, because today this episode is our 300th episode. That's right. It's a special episode. We're going to go 13 minutes. Our 200th was 12. Uh, you know, yep. 100 300 was, episodes is yeah. a huge so, accomplishment. It is. Yeah, yeah it's great. Way more. We, and we than stuck it out, but, but we never Chris, say die. But here's what I'm saying. Chris knows that it's our 300th episode, yeah. and as soon as I hit record, he says, "You're welcome." Right. Right. So what are you trying to? Oh, well, and hold on a second. See how you. see how frazzled he got us. Welcome to the Ten Minute Podcast, yeah. our three hundredth episode. He hijacks. You that go way. Ten Minute Podcast, hit yeah. band, do all band, and did that. Dude, uh, my name is Will, and- the chief engineer no. of laughter and cheer. No. Yeah, over the years. No. 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 Sasso. No. What's your name? Well, I, I'm Brian the Kid Callan, and you know... No, and I am Chris D'Elia, and I don't have a nickname because I'm wrong. What you see is what you get. I understand that. But what's funny is that I wonder after 300 episodes how much we've made on Amazon, and I think we've made in the area of almost $200. <laughs> yeah. Which is, so which is the what banner. you get when you really stick it out and, right. you, know what? and you have faith in years. the process. And our two... And our, Thank you, by the way, yeah, Will, for always our, advertising. And, and t- oh, sure. Always advertising for no reason. Yeah. No, I and, I and I absolutely hate it. I wish you wouldn't do that. So uh, I... I, here's the deal. I, I, I have news for you. Yeah. When we glide softly, when we glide softly into the year 2015, mm-hmm. I'm, I'm already done with. I brought 2015 in 2014. Okay. <laughs> so okay. Cool. I was on my wow, 2015. A it's a bit much. I was on my 2015 shit. That's oh, in fuck. 2014. Can I, t- can I give you a little note for 2015? Yeah. Don't say hip hop stuff without some sort of hip hop tone. No. Because yeah. you said, uh, what did you just say? I didn't. I was on my 2015, 2015 shit. shit. Yeah, that's obnoxious. In 2014. And now. See, I don't I'm know what that means. I'm just about to inch into yeah. revealing and kind of. Owning my 2016 shit. Well, but it's it's not even the end of 2014. It's December 30th. And in also, it feels days, like you're saying you're kind of futuristic and you're ahead of the curve. Is that what you're trying to say? Thank you. I don't know if I'm I trying didn't to say, say that. Don't say thank you because now I didn't. I'm saying, is that how you're, you're thinking you know about what, you're, it? You know what? You're actually, I know what this is coming from. I do have a watch that hasn't come out yet. 
And now, you're, you're, you, you're designing a watch? No, I have a watch. That's that, okay. that that somebody gave Cause, me. Cause, that, oh, that, I want to tell you that doesn't come out yet. Like, like when someone gets a, a cell phone in 2006 right. yeah. from Japan and it has and, video yeah. capability. But there are and you're responding to, to that because you've seen my but, style. But, but, but speaking of, but that was my 2004. The... That was my 2004. Hey, Chris, can I, to, can I say oh, something? Let me say something really you, quick. Well, okay. Because I feel like he's saying he's ahead of the curve. And okay, I think he's saying he's ahead of the curve. And I feel as though if I were to put you in a lineup with the Bee Gees, <laughs> you would fit right in. In fact, I don't know that I would know that I replaced one of the Gibb brothers with your face. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And, and, and let me keep going. Yeah. We could jump ahead. If I were to put you in the Knight Rider, yeah. I'm okay. not sure I would know. And, and while if we're it was you making, or David Hasselhoff. And while we're making uh, <laughs> references right? that, that don't get anywhere past 1982. Sure. Uh, because Brian's bringing up a band largely from the 70s and a show from the 80s. But I think that's I'd like to say point that if to you replaced John Travolta on Welcome Back, Cotter... Oh, I wouldn't blink. I agree. I agree. I honestly agree. I'm, I don't know. My voice is going up, and you'd be Vinny Barbarino. Please, 100%. Well, Vinny Barbarino. A, I, I think. What's up with your that, voice? Um, This is my, well, you know, I'm inching into 2016. 16? Hey, look, uh, is that a mature voice? All right, look, man. What happens actually is the years become shorter for me, and I start doing my years very quickly. Mm. Well, we've are, all you, come are you bending about time? Mar- like, about, about May. Are you, are you Jaden Smith? Are you able to about bend time? May yeah. or June, I'm going to do my 2017 shit. Well, okay. that's good. that harkens back to our and the episode end of called 2000, 2017, and the end of which is 2000, one of the many episodes. And the end oh. of 2015, oh. I will be on my 2018 Okay, okay can, you know we, what? can we just for a second reflect I, on where we've come after yeah, 300 I was just episodes, say, please? Yeah, well, Chris, you're, 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 you're dishing a lot of sauce on what you're saying. Well, where have you come? Three starts, years. I will be years. well into 2019. Hey, bro. No one gives a fuck, man. I still with after, my shit with my shit. After right, 300 look. episodes, I still want to use the back of my hand, the yeah. knuckle part of my yeah. hand, and drive it down at a 45 degree angle <laughs> over nose. across your face and nose. Yeah. I want to do that repeatedly, so that hasn't changed. By me 2025, look, I, I'll be on my 2043, 44 shit. shit. Going to boot your eye. Going to boot your eye. Listen to me. It's been 300 episodes. My this is shorter. This has been awesome. It's been 300 episodes. If you listen to all 300 of them, we we'll appreciate I'm you. I'm on episode 345. Uh, no, you're not, dude. No, you're not, bro. You're about to those get don't sho- exist. You're about to get shooed up right now. Hey, what's How about uh, we shoo you up? Now, I, even though I don't even want to ask Chris this question now, you know what's fuck? I don't want to. Just do it. What? I know. What? Hey, what's changed for you guys in the three near three years that we've Ugh, been doing the show? God, that's okay. don't go first. Do you have a, yeah, go so, ahead. Just get this it over is a with. thirteen minute podcast, right? Yeah, it's gonna uh, be okay. Oh god. No, I'm kidding. But, uh, okay. So um oh, what man. I oh, geez. um what changed it for me, what, what I have to look over my shoulder a lot. Why? Why? Um, Why? Because when I'm walking in and out of He's making a scrunchy face like Ooh, his eyebrows. Yeah, like an apology I, right now. Uh, I I I have I have to Think about you know if I'm showing up to a place like what is the security like? His what eyebrows right now. Like, Are you saying is that because you're going to be mobbed? Yeah, you know Chris. Fans? Chris has got some motherfucking like, eyebrows on him, and we all know that, and they arch thumb, pretty high. Thumb, but right thumb, now thumb. your eyebrows look like a roller coaster. Thumb, thumb, bum, bum, okay. bum, your eyebrows look like two mountain um, peaks. Well, your eyebrows no. look like the end of the movie Alive when the two you know kids are. are <laughs> You know, they're hiking through and they finally reach and which is beautiful helicopter sweeping yeah. the shot. The Hindu Kush. Yeah. Jackets. My jackets got different. I don't give a fuck Because they're more expensive. Brian, what's changed uh, for you? In, a little in, bit. A little bit. Years. But they're also like uh, of like rare animals. Oh, jeez. <laughs> weird. I, weird. I have, uh, I have accomplished all the things I wanted to. I'm a good family man. I have a crazy, crazy uh, one hour I'm about to shoot. Uh, my boxing my, and my footwork my and my, and my tennis. Tennis has gotten way my better. Bank and my bank My French is excellent. Is um, Chris? No hey, one cares Chris, about that. Hey, Chris, it's not all about money. It's about how you're contributing. What are some of your fi- how right. you're growing? And I feel like I'm very proud that we've come through. Hey, you know, episodes. I, I've had a good time with some of the, the 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 people that have dropped by. Why we've had Arnold Schwarzenegger and fans, we've had Jason really. Statham, we've had oh Jason Statham, Jean Claude Van Damme, Jean Claude Van Damme, Steven come Seagal. Up. I think. No, he's never been on the show. We did a little bit that was live with that. We had Hulk Hogan, so much for all of our friends like Canadian Brad and David Greco. 
Greco and everybody's um, dad and Shauna. And also Look, why even Garth Brooks? Hey, Chris, remember when Garth Brooks? Hey, Chris, Twitter Garth Brooks was here. I work flies by, they'll say, and I'll just be like, I don't do it for that, but thank you. You know, you're not even able to listen to anybody anymore. Yeah. You're, so you're so, so, so centered around yourself that you didn't hear no. what we were talking. No, no. <laughs> well, I didn't say, what do you mean, no, no what? I'm not. You're just... Your own, you're the center of your own universe, aren't you? Well, I mean, th- that's funny when people say. What that. kind of shirt am I wearing? Uh, oh my god, you can't even see me. You have a. <laughs> oh my god. Sh- short shirt on. I have a, a black sweatshirt. Right, on. right, 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 right. No, you said a short shirt. Whatever it is, uh, ask me. Is Will other... wearing a hat or not? He's right in front of you. Oh my god. Will has. You're so is. myopic. Chris, you what's your favorite part of doing a podcast with your two friends over the past three years? Oh. Um, f- Holy shit. Oh, no. Oh, Did no. you just come a little bit? He came. Oh, I almost came. Oh. <laughs> is Chris, it because of us? Or are you I'm just, trying, I, Chris, are you just imagining what's going on up in your head? What, what Chris, what are you thinking about right now? What's going on in your head right now? Yeah, what's going on in your there, head? I, I'm... In see? my living room. Okay. And there's... What are you doing? What are you doing in your living room? Well, Who's there? Who's there? There's uh, k- k- three or four pies around. And pies? And these what? girls are feeding me, me. They're feeding you pies? Oh, no. Are you, wait, are you wearing, are you wearing a toga? The only thing I'm you wearing, wearing a is a blazer. I have a blazer oh, on and blazer. that's it. Are you wearing pants? Uh, no, no. I have no pants on. And, uh, oh, okay, you're all hairy and yeah, you're eating pie. And there, we're watching uh, old episodes of Hunter. Why would you watch? At least, I don't at know, least they're because... not watching him. At least they're not watching episodes and, of Hunter. And, wait, wait, and, hold on a second though, Brian. And it's me. Are, yeah, you're Hunter in, in, in it. I'm Hunter. You're Hunter. Oh, in it. Shit. And, it's such a shitty it's, show, it's, dude. It's, it's weird. Why Hunter? And, and then there's guys looking at me. And what are they doing? They're older men that yeah. are saying like, "We've been everywhere. We know right. a lot of things, but." We wish you were you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, are, they, are they writing checks? Ah, that's yes. They're writing checks. Okay. That's right. Uh, for what? Geez. For what? Uh, what is, what's happening to the checks? They're giving them to a a, a guy. <laughs> okay. What guy? Okay. Is he's the guy wearing the, glasses? Is he's he, yeah. He's a diminutive man, perhaps in a suit. Absolutely. He that's looks right. Very a bookish man. Uh, that's right. And okay, that's your accountant, saying, Chris. He, he's saying. Thank you. Okay, that's very this nice. This will be a good addition to Chris's fortune. Oh, oh yeah. Jesus, it's They're account. just writing you random checks. It's it's just, yeah. This is the most narcissistic fantasy I've ever... It's but, a but you asked me. I know, but about, is, there, is there any giving of the money? Are you changing the we're world? giving it to... How? Oh, God. Yeah. I, I can't think that far. Um, <laughs> oh, no. We're giving it to, to other... <laughs> Girls, and oh, you're giving it to girls. You're yeah. spending it on girls, and they're and you're paying them to, to service you. Yeah, yeah, what are they doing? There's candy. I'm There's getting candy. lots of you're candy. I'm candy. Candy. and girls, and they're giving it to me. Mess. And the girls are giving me pies and candy. And they're Chris, come back to us, man. <laughs> <I'm> Fame has <laughs> changed you. It's ruining everything. I have a this blazer is, on it. This, and a blazer. We heard said you. that already. There's oh, wings fuck on this. it. Chris, the blazer has wings on Chris, it. Chris, yeah. come look, look at, at us. Face. Come yeah. back. Drooling. Flying. In it. Oh, man. Oh. Are you flying Are you flying in a sports coming. car? Oh, coming. Oh, are you coming? Oh, Is no. the sports car come I'm power? I'm coming all over. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh. Leather Are you leaving a rainbow interior. behind you? The, oh, Leather man, interior. That's, that's going to be expensive it's to stained. clean up. Yeah, Who's, but the accountant says it's okay. Yeah, of course he what? does. There's all that money from those old guys who've been, who want to be where you are. They're and dead by now. Oh, they died? They just died. Is everybody dead but you now? Yes. And the girls. Oh, you still you, got the girls, Are you though, on right? an island with they're, sugar and cum? They're dead. <laughs> this is the darkest. I'm on, the, I'm on an island. I'm not proud of this Chris. being our 300th episode. Oh, Thank you for listening to 300 Wait, episodes. Wait, there's a what? beam coming a beam. out of you? 